young man, talented in the arts and swaying public's opinion on important issues today. Give it up for Thomas Nash. Woo, 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 woo. Tiger <laughs> and the symbols for the Democratic and Republican Party, the donkey and the elephant. Do you mind if we show some of your pictures? Sure, why not? What's this one? Well, this one is of an American chopping the ponytail off of a Chinese American immigrant and it pretty much shows my views on um, how Americans are trying to make the immigrant population more homogeneous when it comes to um, their culture and wanting them to be more Americanized. Who's that fat lard? <laughs> well this is this is Boss Tweed, and um, it pretty much shows how he's um, a fat, greedy person, and he all he all he cares about is votes, and n not about the interests in the immigrants or the poor. Wow, this looks like that same fat lard. Well, it is. And this is Boss Tweet again, and it, this shows that his brain is made of money, and all he thinks about is money, and he's greedy and horrible. And this is my drawing of the Tammy Tiger. That's amazing! So what's with all the Boss Tweet cartoons? Ah, uh, don't even get me started on Tweety. Come on, he's not even here. Okay. He was a greedy political machine that took advantage of and manipulated immigrants. He only coordinated the needs of the businesses, immigrants, and the underprivileged. Whoa, take it easy! <laughs> and he asked for their votes in return. Tweety was a real prick. <laughs> You also have cartoons that are for anti-immigration. But correct me if I'm wrong, you're an immigrant too, aren't you? Well, yes, but I'm not a bogus Irish Catholic immigrant. I'm a respectful German Protestant from the Northeast side. This concludes our video with Thomas Nast. You've all been a wonderful audience. Thank you all for coming and watching our interview. I hope you tune in next week for our special on Theodore Roosevelt.